So you might be trying to figure out how you can go ahead and find out your battery health on your particular iPad. Now, you may know this, it's not built inside of the settings or anything like that, but to do this, it's very basic. What we're going to use is a, um, an amazing Siri shortcut that this particular user built out, and I will leave this link down in the description, so all you're going to have to do is basically just utilize this particular link, and you will want to go ahead and click on that link, and you want to, when you do it, it'll take you right into your shortcuts application, and you want to go and click add shortcut. So all you're going to want to do is click on add shortcut. Hopefully you don't already have it. If you have it, then that's fine. But if not, then that's totally okay. Add shortcut. And then what you're going to want to do is you want to hop inside of your settings application. So open up settings, you'll come right into here. What you're then going to want to do, you want to click on privacy and security, which is right here. And then what you're going to want to do is you want to scroll down on your privacy and security portion, and you want to go and click on analytics and improvement. So tap right there. And then when you come into this next page, you want to go and click on analytics data. So tap on analytics data right there. And then you'll see a bunch of these files that will basically just populate over here. Now, if you don't see any, you may have to toggle on a certain thing. But if you do see some, hopefully, I think every single person should see something here. Now, it can be kind of hit or miss. But what you want to find out is any of these files that say analytics, that start with analytics, and end with something that looks like this. Now, when you open the file, it'll look something like this. It'll have like a bunch of text to it. Now, it's, it can be hit or miss. You may have to try this. Hopefully, you have multiple files like I do. For me personally, what I had to do was click on the second file that I saw here. And what you're going to want to do, in the top right corner, you want to click on this share icon. So tap on share. And then you should be able to see that battery health Siri shortcut icon. If you don't see it, you may have to open up Siri shortcuts and then click on that. And you should be able to see it there. Then what you want to do is you want to tap on battery health and watch what happens. It will go ahead and run this thing at the very top and it will automatically show me my battery health. So it tells me your iPad battery health is 96%, which is probably accurate. Now that saves me from having to scroll through this whole entire file and try to find the 90, like battery health, whatever, and try to find in you know, the screen. It allows me to just circumvent that and just basically have it from there, which is really cool. So that's basically how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.